Jean, good morning. Good morning. Jean, hello. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Wait. I don't hear you. Good afternoon. Are there Are there one minute? Good afternoon. 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 Good Hmm? Who is talking? Okay. Hello, check on, check on, check on. Yes, good morning, everybody. Can you hear me right now? If you can hear me, please write your name. Write your name through chat. Write your name, chat box. Okay, I'm waiting for you. Yes. I want to see everybody's name. Okay, very good. Please, just you should try all things related to our class. Okay, we are following. They are following your chat box. Good morning, everybody. Okay, let's start our topics. By the way, who will tell me in last time what did we learn? In last time, we have learned software. Who remembers in software what did we learn? Raise your hand. What is software? Who wants to answer? Raise your hand. I will give you right. Okay, I will unmute you. Raise your hand. Who wants to answer the definition of software? What software? Who will tell me? Yes. Yes, Jamil. Can you tell me what is software? Jamil, hmm? you can talk. You can talk. What is software? Sir? What is definition of software? Can you tell me? <laughs> software. Is yes. Software is the, the inner part, the part that is not physical in the computer, that works. It, um, it directs the hardware. It mm -hmm. shows us. Um, is is the thing that is not physical on the computer? You are saying software is controlling hardware. This definition. Okay, let's ask another one. Anybody has any idea about it? What is software? Who wants to do answer? Raise your hand, I can see you already. Yes, Brad, you tell me. What's the definition of software? You can talk now. Yes, talk loudly. All right. I cannot hear you. Or you can write chat box. Okay, write definition in chat box. I can follow you. Write chat box. Okay, because I cannot hear you because of maybe you have some problem through your voice. Check it again. Yes, another one. Ridwan. This question for you. Yes. Do we have how many kinds of That's software? It. How many kinds of software we have? Can you tell us? Two. Two kinds of. Can you tell me their name? Uh, 
Yes, Ridwan, do you remember? Application software. Very good. And? Application software. And? System software, yes. If you remember. Yes, yes. Yes, thank you, Ridwan. Then who will tell me what is system software? Anybody can tell me? Raise your hand, I can see you. Just we are recapping previous week. You should know it. Another one. Yes, Sherif. Sherif, what is system software? Do you know what system software? Sherif, you can talk. Sherif, can you hear me? You can talk. Who wants to the answer? Who wants to give the answer? Raise your hand. What is system software? Daramola? Demola, sorry. What is system software? Anybody can tell me? Yes, Rukeve, you tell me. What is system software? Rukeve. What is system software? System software. System software is software that allows the computer to protect the information and work properly. Very good. Thank you, Rukeve. Then, then who will tell me what application software? Application software. Who can tell me? Raise your hand. I want to see you. I want to see new hand, new face. Yes. What is application software? Just Brian knows it. No anybody knows what is application software. You may know it because we have I have told you before. What application software? Yes, Herida, can you hear me? Herida. Yes, sir. What application software? Do you know it? What application software? Uh, application software. Do you know it? I don't know. You don't know it? No. Who wants to help Herida? What application software? She said, I don't know. Who can help her? Yes. Jamil, you tell me what application software, Jamil. Yes. Application software is um the software that controls apps. Apps in um in a computer, in devices. Okay. Good. Another idea? Ridwan, are you there? Ridwan Arasi. You, you yes. tell me, what is application software? Do you have any idea about application software? Application software is like the type of software which controls um, application apps on the computer or desktop. On the computer or desktop. Thank you. Then let's go to Bright. Last one, Bright, then we will start our Brad, I cannot hear you. You should check your volume, your voice. Yes, right? Or you can write chat box because I cannot hear you. Maybe you have voice problem. Click on your screen, right? Sherif, Sherif, can you hear me? Yes, Sherif, you tell what's application software. Now you can hear me, I think. What is the application software, Sherif Oba? Share it right through chat box because I cannot hear you and write. Write through chat box. What application for that? Then now, today we will start our new topic. Let's start the topic. Operating system. What's operating system? Operating system. Anybody know operating system? Rukeve, are you there? Okay, can you hear me? Yes, tell me operating system. What is the definition of operating system? Have you heard before operating system? Okay, this question for you. Today, you learn operating system. If you know it before, you can tell me. You can talk. Okay, okay. Yes. Allow computer to function properly. 
Thank you, Ruke. Then let's see definition of operating system. As you can see, operating system is software program that manages the hardware and software resources of a computer. Mean operating system which can manage hardware and software. You are calling operating system. Okay. Already we shared this video through with uh, YouTube. You can you can watch it again. But if you want to write some important point, you can write. Yes. Demola. Demola, are you there? Yes, sir. Demola, what is operating system? Operating system is operating system is a software program that manages the hardware and software resources of the computer. Thank you. Very good. Let's go to your site. Who are there in your section? Let's see. Yes. Iman. What's operating system? Are you there? Hardware and software. Yes. Okay. Omena, can you hear me? What's operating system? Yes, Omena, this question for you too. What's operating system? Omena, this question for you. I think Omera cannot connect to us. Let's ask another one. I want to see new face. Who are they? Who are there? Let's see. Yes. Rehan. Rehan, you tell me what operating system? Operating system um, is like is like something that they use to like manage the both like the hardware and the software of the computer. Very good. Thank you, Rehan. Thank you so much. Then let's continue our slideshow. You can see some examples of operating system like Linux, Unix, Windows 7, Windows 10, or Mac operating system. You can see those are we call all right. All right. Sorry, I'm going to remove you again because I want you previous lesson and I want you now. Now I'm going to remove you. Sorry. As you can see, Linux, Unix, Windows 7, Windows 10, those are examples of operating system. Then let's continue. Why does a computer need an operating system? Why? Who can tell me? Why does a computer need an operating system? Who can tell me? Rehan, are you there? Rehan. Uh -huh. Can you hear me? Why? Does a computer need an operating system? What do you think? Mm. To make sure the computer works smoothly. Mm. Another idea? Omena, can you to hear me? To make sure the computer works very well. Very good, okay. Good. Another, who wants to answer? Why? Does a computer need an operating system? Who can? Who can answer it? Write your hand. Yes. Yes, you can tell me. Rahmet. For easy interaction between human and computer. Very good. Thank you. By the way, what is your name? Rodia. 
Rodia, okay, thank you. Can I see your Rodia. Name? Okay, Rodia. Then another idea. Omena. Omena. Sir. Yes, you can tell me why does a computer need Ujang. an operating system? Why does a computer need an operating system? Do you have any idea? To control Controlling input yes, and output devices. Very good. Thank you, Omena. Another, let's go to Halima. Halima, you tell me. Halima, can you hear me? Halima? I think Halima is connected. Yes, select another one. Rukeve, are you there? Rukeve. Why does a computer need an operating system? Do you have any idea about it? Why? Why we computer need an operating system? Yes, look at Okay. Thank you, Rukeve. As you can see, why does a computer need an operating system? First, you can see is the interaction between humans and computers. And starting computer when the power is turned on, controlling input and output, controlling program input, managing use of main memory. Let's continue. Now we have type of operating system. We have four types of operating system. One is real-time operating system. Meaning we can set RTOS, real-time operating system. Anybody aware about real-time operating system? Raise your hand. Who can tell me real-time operating system? Yes. Yes, Rodia, you tell me. What is real-time operating system? You raise your hand. We are aware about real-time operating system. Rodia. I raised my hand for the last question. Okay, then again, you can question. answer it, maybe. Do you aware about real-time operating system? You don't know? Then, okay, then let's go to Rehan. Yes, Rehan. Do you aware about real-time yes, operating sir. system? What is real-time operating system? Have you heard before? I don't think I've heard of it before. Okay, then let me tell you what is real-time operating system. The user do not have much control over. I mean, this, we are talking about real-time operating system. Function performed by RTO. I mean, you don't have any interact with this device. Function I mean, function doing by real-time operating system, everything. Like you can see, it has little user interface capability, like bank. Maybe you, when you are going to bank, you are going to cash, you are taking your money. Just you, are, you have small work with that. Majority, bank is doing by itself. ATM, ATM bank. Yes. And you can see advantages and disadvantages of real-time operating system. It is quick response time, near perfect execution of job, and this advantage is very costly. It is very expensive, as you know. Large memory required. And second one is single user, single task operating system. I think you have aware about it. Single task, single user. Yeah, then tell me, what is Mino? Single user, single task operating system. What can be? Like, um, you already can understand product like, names. Single user, single task operating system. Yes, Rehan. Like, it allows, it allows the user to, like, to do only, only one thing Very at good. a time. Yes, just you can do, you can do just one thing in at one time. Thank you, Rehan. If another body wants to participate, please raise your hand. Let's see another. 
Yes, Rizwan. Rizwan, you tell me. Have you heard single user, single task operating system? What is single user, single task operating system? As in, sorry? What is single Have user, I seen it before? single user, single task operating system? What it can be by its name? Uh, is a kind of operating system which yes. allows yes, really users good. to do one thing at a time. So as the which by, allow do icons. one thing something like in a one time. Yes. Sorry. Yes, I can hear you. Can talk. Yes, continue. Like so, it is. Some people use it so they will not get confused because there are some there are some operating systems which can not bring not allow the user to do one thing at a time. I mean like five times at a time, six at a time, some at a time. Thank you, Ruzwan. Let's go to Rukeve. Where's Rukeve? Yes, Rukeve. What do you think about single user, single task operating system? Yes, Rukeve. Single user staff operating system for only one person. Do one thing at the same time. You cannot do more than one thing at the same time. Only one person. Okay, thank you. As you can see, example is the those which allow only one user run a single program at a one time. This is one example of single user, single task operating system. Means just is allow one person do one work in a one time. This is type of operating system. Then let's continue. Advantages of it is very fast and very powerful, easy to use. You can see this advantage. Let's move here. It is this advantage is no build in support for network. Support just one user at a one time. Just you can use one person can use it. That's why this is these advantages of this one. But it's very fast and very powerful. And you can see third one, single user multitask. What does it mean? Single user multitask. Yes, what do you think? Anybody knows about it? Single user multitask. Yes, Rodiat. Do you want to answer something? You are following very well, but I hope you can understand it. Or I can explain. Yes, what, no, what do you think about single user multitask? It allows the user to run, can run more than one app at the same time. Very good. Thank you, Rodiat. You are saying allow single user run multiple application at the same time I mean it can run more than one application in a one time but in previous time just it can run one application just another another idea let's go to different student Ayomide you are there Jamil can you hear me Jamil yes Jamil yes, sir. what do you think about single user Multitask. It allows people to use only um, one thing at a time. Computer. Me allow single user run multiple application in a one time. Okay, thank you, Jamil. Another who wants to participate? Raise your hand, please. If you have any question, you can write ch chat box. I can see your question through chat box. Yes, Iman. Can you hear me? Hello, everyone. Yes, Iman. Iman, I think you are writing now. Demola. 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 Where is Demola? Faisal. Demola. Go 
Gun. Can you hear me, Gun? I can see you now. Yes, Gum, you tell me. What do you think about single user multitask? Single user multitask is when single user multitask is when um, it allows only one user to use more than one of multiple apps at the same time. Thank you so much, Gum. Very good. Sir? Thank you so much. Very good. Yes, Faisal. Let me catch Faisal. Yes, Faisal. Can you hear me, Faisal? Can you hear me? What do you think about single user multitask? Yes, Faisal. You can talk now. Faisal, are you there? I think you cannot hear me. Yes, Faisal. Now I can hear you. Ridwan. Yes, Ridwan. What do you think? Single user multitask. You, ra you raise your hand. What do you think about it? I think you know it now. What does it mean, single user multitask? I'm like... Sorry, it's like... It's an yeah. operating system which... I, you know, you can, it, can, it allows the user to do multiple things at the, like, at the same time. Okay. Like... Yes? Continue. It can be an advantage because nobody wants to work faster. Once you finish something early, you can just use it so he can finish his work early. But it also has a disadvantage. What is the disadvantage? person really tired. It can make somebody really get tired. Okay, then let's see these advantages. Advantages and disadvantages. Oh. You can see advantages. Central location for the installation and administration of all software data and cost effective. It is uh, not expensive than another. It is low price, you can take it. And this energy is single source for possible problem. It can cause problem for person. And only one user can access the system. Just one person can do. But this person can do multiple application. Then let's continue. Then last one is multi-user operation system. What is multi-user operating system? This is the last one, fourth one. Who will tell me? Multi-user operating system. Let's go to Halima. Halima, are you there? Yes, Halima. Alima, I can hear you. Yes, you can talk. What is multi-user operating system? Yes, Halima, I think cannot, cannot talk. Yes, select new one. Please, you should participate, okay? Let's go to Demola, you tell me. Yes, Demola. Um, yeah. First of all, what is multi-user operating system? So, multi-user operating here. Yes, so, I can hear you. I can hear you, you can talk. What is multi-user operating system? As you can see, permit multiple users use the same computer at the same time. So you can see 
there means multiple user use the same computer the same. Emoji is a emoji user operating system is a computer operating system which allows multiple users to access the single system with one operating system on it Halima oh I'm going to remove you I'm going to wait one minute Last time. Yes, Demola, I can hear you. You can talk. You are saying permit multiple users. A multi user operating system. Is it? A multi-user operating system is a computer operating system which allows multiple users to access the single system with one operating system on it. Thank you so much, Demola. Thank you. As you can see, example for it, Linux, Unix, those are multi-user operating systems. And let's continue. As you can see, advantages, increases, Productivity, reduce work time. These advantages regularly maintained and updated high cost of purchase. These are advantages and disadvantages. Then let's, we have question now. You will be asked question. Just raise your hand, okay? This first question. Raise your hand just. You can see which one is the type of and operating system. Raise your hand just. Yes, I can see your hand. Raise your hand. Yes, Galaxy, Samsung Galaxy. This question for you. Yes, Samsung Galaxy. I cannot recognize so, your face. I think you can see question. Yes, what is the answer? So all of the above. All of the above. The body, what is your name? Daniel Adelo. Daniel Adelo. Okay. Thank you, Daniel. You are seeing all about them. Yeah. Who is challenging this? Challenging yeah. this? Ridwan? Yes, go to Ridwan. Arasi. Yes, Ridwan. You also can answer it. Ridwan, can you hear me? Ridwan Arasi. This question for you too. Which one is the type of an operating system? Uh, what does she expect to find one more time? I think Ridwan is busy. Let's move another one. Just raise your hand. Sherif, I think I cannot hear you, but you can write the chat. What is the answer? Sherry. Which one is the type of operating system? Real-time operating system, single user, single type operating system, single user, multitask operating system, all, 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 all about them. Right? Through chat, I can see your answer. All about them. Thank you so much, Sherry. Next question. Next question, who want to answer this question? Just raise your hand. What type of operating system include those features? First feature is the user do not have much control over functions performed by the dash. The dash has little user interface capability. ATM use this operating system. ATM use for this operating system. Yes, let me see another face. Yes, Rehan. What is your idea, Rehan? Now you can talk. What type of operating um, system include those features? Yes, Rehan. Um,
If you don't have, you can pass. Who wants to help Rehan? Who wants to help? Real time operating systems. Real time operating system. Yes, Real let's go to. Okay, let's go to Ridwan. Ridwan maybe is challenging. Yes, Ridwan. Yes. B. You are saying answer is B. B. Real time operating system. Let me see the answer. Yes, sir. Yes. Thank you so much. You are correct. Next question. Who is that? Yes, Ridwan, thank you. Next question for. Let's go to different person. Mm. Yes, Ferida. Ferida, can you hear me? Then let's go to another one. I think Ferida cannot connect. Let's go to who is Fatia Akinola. Can you hear me? Fatia Akinola. What type of operating system permits multiple users use the same computer at the same time? Fatia, are you there? Raise your hand. Who wants to answer this question? Raise your hand. Bright. Multi-user operating system, someone says. Terida, you are saying multi-user operating system. Let's see. Yes, aunt, you are correct, Terida. I can see from chat. Okay, I'm following you. Thank you. Next question. This question is, what type of operating system allows only one user do one thing at a one time? Yes. Sheriff, you tell me. Sheriff, you can write chat box. Or you can talk. Because I cannot hear you. You can write chat box. Let me answer. Single user, single task operating system. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. Next question, just raise your hand. What type of operating system include those features? Allow single user run multiple applications at the same time. They increase productivity and are mostly more work is done in a shorter time. Examples include Mac operating system, Windows operating system. What type of operating system include those features? Raise your hand just. Let me see chat. Answer is coming. Answer is Rice. Single tag, single user. Serida, she says answer is D. If Sherif also says answer is D. Who is challenging them? They are saying single user multitask operating system. Yes, answer is single task multitask operating system. Okay, nickname Handia. We are going to remove you. We know what's wrong with you. Sorry. The yes, answer is single user multitask operating system. Thank you. Those who has written 
through chat. Let me check your answer. Yes. Answer is single user multitask of an instant. Let's see. Last question. Who wants the answer? Who wants to give answer? Yes. Rehan, this question for you. Rehan. Yes, sir. Yeah, this question for you. Why does a computer need an operating system? A. Is in the interaction between humans and computers. Oh, all, of, all of the above. All of them. All above Are you sure? them. D. Yes. The answer is D. Let's go to Rukeve. Where is Rukeve? Where is Rukeve? Let's go to. Yes, Rukeve. Let's go to him. Yes, Rukeve. What do you think about this question? Why does a computer need an operating system? Rukeve. All above them. All above them. Thank you. Yes, let's go to Demola. Yes, Demola, what do you think? All of the above. Oh. All above them. Okay. Thank you. This is your assignment. Then let's list three examples of operating system. Then let's play small game. Okay. Last, write your assignment. Yes, sir. Three examples of an operating system. Then let's start our game. Okay. Just raise your hand. I'm not muted. We have matching game in our previous classes. Who wants to match CPU? CPU should match with function. I, 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 I. Yes? I sound much. Okay, then tell me answer. What is CPU? Tell me, Rayhan. CPU. CPU. Central processing unit. Central ce central processing unit. Are you sure? Yes, sir. Yes. Congratulations. You are correct, Rehan. Let's next question. Random access memory should match with which one? Raise your hand just. Random access memory. Yes. You tell me. Rodiat, this question for you. Yes, sir. What is random access memory? Sorry? Can I repeat the question? What should be matched with random access memory? Opposite of, you can see operating system, you can see RAM, you can read only memory, internet protocol. Which option should be matched with random access memory? Sorry? Yes, Rodiel, can you hear me? Repeat the question. Um, question is, you can see yes. random access memory. Which option should be matched with it? You can see operating system, RAM, read-only memory, internet, internet protocol. Which I should see match? my screen. Mm, I think. RAM. You are saying answer is RAM. Okay, let me check. Yeah. Okay, thank you, Rodiat. You are correct. Hello, man. Uh, next question, what is IP? Abbreviation of IP. Who will tell me? Just raise, you, raise your hand. Bright, you tell me, Bright. Iman. Bright, this question for you. IP. What's abbreviation IP? 
which can be matched with this. Rodia, please, I can hear you. Yes, sir. Listen to your friend. What is the answer? What did you say, sir? I'm saying I can hear you. What is the answer? For what, sir? IP. Gum. I. Next question for you. Yes, Gum, you tell me. Samsung Galaxy Gum. Or Daniel. Yes, Samsung Galaxy. Yeah. Information technology. Information technology, IP. Abbreviation of IP is you are saying information technology. Are you sure? Yes. Who is challenging you? Yes. Yes, Gum. Iman, how are you? Jam, information, te information technology is like the method, the way I met that information and um, information or uh, messages are being passed out from one person or one place to the other. It's like transportation of information through electric electronic means. Okay, thank you. Jam means transformation of of. Okay, thank you, Gam. Then how about uh, R O M? Rom. What is abbreviation of Rom? Who is telling me? Okay, this question for you. Yes, look at it. What's the abbreviation of Rome? R O M. R O M. Read only memory. Read only memory. Let me match it. Yes, you are correct. Then what is abbreviation of OS? Today we have learned. Operating. Operating system. Operating. Thank you. Then last question. What is abbreviation of IP? IP. Or we have one option, as you can see, Internet Protocol. Thank you so much. Yep. Have a good day, everybody.